In this part, we go to the Lighthouse to validate the aspect of the Progressive Web App. To go to the Lighthouse, we have to go to the three dots and go to More Tools, go to Developer Tools, and then we can tap on the Lighthouse. And then we just take the Progressive Web App, and then we click on Generate Report. And then in this part, we just focus on these field problems. The first one is the manifest do not have a PNG icon of at least 512 pixels. And actually, when we generate the icons with Android SS Studio, there are two PNG files. One is 1024 times 1024 and the other is 512 pixels so we can copy these two to our project we put it inside our icons folders and then we back to our manifest and now we duplicate these two objects and then we know the page store is 512 so we change this to play store dot png and this is 512 times 512 and this is app store and then this is 1024 times 1024 so we fix these problems if we clear this and then generate the report again now you can see it already turned green so we can fix the other problems is we haven't set a film colors so what is the film color the film color actually is the color of the address bar so if we set the film color you will see this color appear inside the address bar when you open it inside the mobile so we back to our coding and we go to the index and on the top of the title we give a meta tag and the name is film color and the content is the color code and so we can copy from the manifest because we also have the color of the background color we can use the same and paste it to our content and then we copy and paste to each of the HTML file. Now we can generate the report again. Now you see the set film color also turns green. And at last, the manifest doesn't have a maskable icon. And this we can skip this first because later we will deploy it to the web or we will use localhost. So we can ignore these problems because the service workers work on HTTPS and also localhost. So back to the maskable icon and we can click on learn more. You can see to add a maskable icon, we have to go to the manifest and choose one of the icons and add the purpose and the maskable. And it also mentioned maskable icon is a new icon format that ensures that your progressive web app look great on all Android devices. So now we follow this instruction and back to our project and go to the manifest. And maybe we also choose a similar size and then we paste the purpose of any maskable and we save all. So we generate the report again. Now you can see all the problems are fixed.